at the La Polina Cigar Company, and I'm here with Cheryl, and she's going to tell us a little bit about their line. Cheryl, can you tell me a little bit about the blends that you have here on your table today? Yes, I can. Um, we have um, so many. It's a boutique uh, brand, and uh, it, it was uh, Mr. Paley is the owner, Mr. Bill Paley. And we have a new family series that is out right now, and the country of origin is the USA. It's made out of El Teton de Bronze in Miami. Uh, fabulous construction. That's who also makes our Mr. Sam and our Goldie. Um, and the, uh, the family series, the wrapper is Ecuador Corojo 98, the binders Ecuador Habano, and the filler is Nicaraguan. Then uh, we have the brand new Red Label, which has actually taken the cigar world by storm. Um, we brought it out for the big trade show in New Orleans, IPCPR, and we actually can hardly keep it in stock. I mean, I... Okay, continue talking. Okay, so the Red Label is, is my new favorite cigar of all time. Um, the country of origin is uh, Dominican Republic. And the wrapper is Ecuador Habano, which gives it that little bit of spice. It's actually a mild uh, to medium cigar, but the spice is amazing. And when you smoke the new Red Label, it's a different cigar throughout the entire smoke. And it has such a fabulous finish. I just, um, I'm just amazed, as is everyone else, because people call it at me every day asking for the new Red Label, even though it's just hitting the shelves now. Now, which cigar did you give our cameraman, Denny, to try? Denny, um, oh. did I give you the black label? And the black label... Paired, he loved this. Yes. He's, oh, no. He was very happy with it. That, that's one of our best sellers. The black label pairs very well with a red label. Um, in the humidor, it's, it's uh, the red label, the black label plays off each other. The red label, again, being the mild. The black label's a, a full body. But it's, a, it's, it's not harsh in any way. I'm not a Maduro girl, but the black label is so flavorful. And again, a great finish, uh, not harsh. It's a very smooth smoke. I uh, love the black label. And I knew you'd like the black label, so that's why I wanted you to try it. You know, a lot of people don't, and I, obviously people who smoked for years and have their own humidors and, and are used to it know that you, there are certain cigars that you shouldn't put in the same humidor. But a lot of people, especially new smokers, don't realize that some sticks that you put together, they all take the other flavors or... or you know, they don't mix well. And when you're saying that those two blend well together, that's what made me think that we should mention that every once in a while. Because you'll pick up something and then the next time you go to smoke it and you say, oh, I thought I liked this, but it doesn't taste the same. Right. That right. could be why. It could be. Yeah. It could be. So, so it is a little tip for, for the newbie smokers. That yes. Yes, definitely. Keep another little box for those you know, cigars, especially the infused or flavored ones, because they'll really change your yes. your humidor. Yes, and we don't have the uh, flavored or infused um, cigars. But if you stick a couple in your box, they'll yes. definitely change your De cigars. Absolutely. <laughs> and I do have to uh, give a mention to my go-to everyday cigar, which is a Mr. Sam. Fabulous, fabulous smoke. Um, it just is, it's a very mellow, um, it's a very mellow cigar. The country of origin is USA, made with the Goldies in the Family Series out of El Teton de Bronze in Miami. Uh, it's a, it's a wrapper is Ecuador, binder Nicaragua, filler Nicaragua. And everyone says it's like a, a medium to full, but to my palate, it's definitely a mild to medium. It's just a very nice cigar. I love the Mr. Sam. And unlike the the new Red Label, that it, it you enjoy a different uh, a different cigar throughout the entire smoke. For me, the the Mr. Sam, it just has this lovely mellow, just a very mellow flavor and smoke from beginning to end. So I, I love the Mr. Sam. Let me see this one, Mr. Sam. A good everyday, consistent smoke. And it's good for any time of the day? It is, although for the everyday cigar, um, our classic is a mild, um, and, and for the average uh, worker, 
this is their go-to cigar, sweet spot for the price, uh, mild, and um, for me, I just like a little more excitement. Okay. So I, I love the spice and um, a little more of a medium body. Okay. So, but so for, the, for the classic everyday smoker, the, the mild, uh, the classic is awesome. Thank you very much. That's the La Polina line. Thank you very much. You're so welcome.